Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager. Ooh. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am playing some Dragon Age Inquisition. Yes, more Inquisition, because guess what? Yesterday, well, I guess you guys are going to see this a week after it happens, but yesterday they released the final DLC. What in the world? There is something underneath the floor there. It's called Dragon Age Inquisition Trespasser. I know Solus is in it. I know it takes place two years after the base game. I have equipped everybody with better armor. I have tinted the armor. We've got spiffy stuff. Let's go do the last DLC of Dragon Age Inquisition. And after that, we are done with this game. If you ever see anything else of it, it'll probably be, be the DL the multiplayer DLC. What other DLC? This is the last DLC! Attend the Exalted Castle. Warning. Begin the attend. So we'll lock off all of the areas and plots and jump to 944 Dragon, two years after if the death squint, of Griffius. Lake Kalanhad is shaped like a bunny. Really? Perhaps we should take a... <laughs> oh, I think I see it. Aw, that's adorable. Griffius dead and the threat of the Fade Rifts and Demons waning. Both Orlea and Ferelden have begun to raise questions about the future of the Inquisition. Divine Victoria, Leliana, has promised to shield the Inquisition from political matters for as long as possible. Eventually, she plans to call the Exalted Council, attempts to determine the role and possibly the fate of the Inquisition. Let's do the thing! Attend the Exalted Council. Would you like to gather your party and venture forth? Yes! Some people could be gone here. Because in the two year span, people can actually leave the Inquisition. Like, we might not have Vivienne. Please tell me we still have Varric, Sarah, and Iron Bull. I will be very sad if we don't have Varric, Sarah, and Iron Bull. This thing is, they're the ones who got the spiffy new tinted armor. Uh-oh. What have they been doing the last two years? Just cleaning up house? Aw, oh, I got my spiffy, uh, my spiffy threads now. It's okay, Colin. Smiles, everyone. We must be careful how we present ourselves. Why did Divine Victoria call the Exalted Council? She's kept Orlay from bothering us for the last two years. At increasing political cost, yes. She has done all she can, but the Exalted Council has become necessary. Orlay well, he's got a would point there, us, I mean. And based on their many marriage proposals, they have specific plans. <laughs> God damn it. The like Our ah. real concern is Ferelden. They would see us disbanded entirely. Alistair would do that to us. Alistair loves us. Well, he loves my Grey Warden, at least. And I know my Grey Warden. She, she would never have the uh, Inquisition disbanded. Everything's quiet. Why is it quiet? That's bad. <laughs> Inquisitor, it has been too long. I hope the years have been kind to you. I remember you. How have you been, Mother Giselle? Hi, Giselle. I spent last summer in Empress du Lyon, distributing food sent from the exalted plains. The Dales are finally recovering. That's good. Thanks to you, honey buns. Corypheus left a great deal of damage for us to repair. I appreciate your efforts. And I yours, your worship. I'm I should call me your worship. Your horses at Suladin Keep were of great help. No problem. Please give my compliments to Baron Deschedin. Divine we're Victoria awesome. asked me to greet you on her behalf. She is currently attending to the Ferelden ambassador's concerns. You mean Leliana? You can probably just call her Leliana in private conversation. You can. <laughs> you can! I prefer to use her divine name. Fine. Our last divine once joked about why I insisted upon calling her Justinia. She called it my way of reassuring her that I had not completely forgotten who was in charge. <laughs> How's she doing? How's Liliana How doing? How do you think Divine Victoria has done these last two years? It is hardly for me to say, Inquisitor. 
Oh, with respect, that's <laughs> never stopped <laughs> you before, <laughs> Mother Giselle. She's got a point Victoria there. Victoria is proving to be a woman that few dare to disagree with. She has already won concessions for the Inquisition. You are fortunate to have her support. That's good. Let's go find her. I'll speak to Divine Victoria. I believe she would appreciate that, Your Worship. The Divine sees the good that you can do and have done. <clears throat> Duke Yay! Ciro will wish to greet you on behalf of Ole. I believe he is currently speaking with the Tevinta ambassador. There's a Tevinta ambassador? Many of your friends have returned as well. I hope you oh! have a chance to speak with them before the Exalted Council begins. Yes, 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 yes. The Imperium sent an ambassador. Yes, Your Worship. Dorian Please Pavas tell me Beric's still here and Sarah and Ironbull. It will be good to see Oops. him again. I owe him my apology. I allowed my distrust of Divinta to cloud my judgment. He took a great risk coming to help us and deserved better treatment. Is it Dorian? You're going to apologize. It's Dorian. Dorian. Hi, Dorian. I have little patience for those who cannot admit they were wrong, Your Worship. Myself included. Oh, well, that's good. I will have to make my apology somewhere public. He will want an audience for his reaction. Ha! Ha! Which old friends? Who has returned for the Exalted Council? Your dwarven friend, Mel. Yes! <laughs> for one, I understand he spent much of the last few years in Kirkwall. Yay! I believe Sir Blackwall has returned really? as well, although he now uses the name Tom Ranier. That makes Enjoy sense. Enjoy time with them while you can. Your Wait, just them? I doubt you will have the chance once the Exalted Council is underway. J j j j j j just, just them? Thank you, Mother Giselle. Your I did better than that! A final question, if I may. This Exalted Council, Thorelden would have the Inquisition disband. Ole sees its power as another feather in a chevalier's helmet. Ah! What do you wish to do with the Inquisition? We're not going anywhere. The Inquisition still has work to do. We can't let someone's fear push us into disbanding. Then I wish you luck in the negotiations to come. This is going to end poorly. <laughs> Make a watch over you, Inquisitor. I will not keep you any longer. Thank you, Giselle. This is going to end poorly. Oh boy. Just Blackwall and Varric. Really? Seriously? No Iron Bowl, no Sarah. I'm going to be very, very angry if I have to do this entire thing with just Varric and Iron Bowl. Hi, 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 Varric. The Prince of Starkhaven wrote to you again. Uh oh. Of course he did. <laughs> just. Put that one in the pile with letters from the Merchants Guild. Ha! And the captain of the city guard had a very colorful message for me to deliver to you as well. Evelyn! Inquisitor! Andraste's ass, am I ever glad to see you? Hi there, how you doing? Are you in some kind of trouble? What's happened this time? <laughs> so suspicious. I'll have you know Just I've never been convicted of anything. Officially. But you've done this things. Grand Caven. Until recently, he was the Viscount. Viscount? Viscount. Of Kirkwall. Of Kirkwall. Uh oh. Are you here to represent Kirkwall in the Exalted Council, Viscount Bran? Provisional Viscount, which sadly is no longer my office. Who, who's Viscount then? My post is it Hawk? Now that Master Tethras has been elected. <gasps> oh my God! Why? <laughs> the Viscount of Kirkwall now. <laughs> Well, it seems the two of you have a great deal to discuss. Why don't I just leave you to it? There is so, the Viscount of Kirkwall? You fund enough reconstruction efforts in a city-state, the nobles give you the worst job, job they, they can think, think of. of. <laughs> oh my god, that's kind of amazing. Does this mean I can't tempt you into coming back to Skyhold? Wicked Grace hasn't been the same since you left. I'm probably going to be stuck in Kirkwall for the foreseeable future. <laughs> There's a lot to do back home. God damn it. They voted me in because I got the harbor and businesses up and running again. They want shit fixed, and I can do that. Anyway, I was hoping I'd catch damn you it. before the summit got underway. I got you a sort of present. Really? It's official recognition of your title and holdings in Kirkwall. I've got a mansion in Kirkwall? Congratulations. You're a Comtesse now. 
Cool. You can't actually do that without it. Too late. Already did it. <laughs> Already did it. <laughs> you should stop by Hightown sometime to see your estate. It's pretty nice. For Kirkwall, anyway. Proper disposition of empty estates is supposed to... <clears throat> you were leaving us to talk, remember? <laughs> I love you, Varric. Please tell me I can at least have him in my party for when everything goes to shit. Please? Please? I don't ask for much. This is possibly too much, Varric. I don't know what to say. That's nothing. Practically nothing. Don't mention it. I know how to mention. That reminds me. It's the key to the city. You can't give that away with <laughs> approval from the council and a special ceremony. It's I feel it's sorry for Bran. Anyway. I feel sorry for Bran. It controls one of the giant chain nets in the harbor. Really? That is so much better than I thought. Can I try it out? This operates those giant chains. Can I try it? No. No! I don't know how this council thing is going to end for the Inquisition. But whatever gets decided, you've got a place lined up in Kirkwall if you want it. Also, uh, control of the harbor, I guess. <laughs> anyway, Beric. you should meet with the diplomats. And we'll get in a game of Wicked Grace before I go back, though, right? I wouldn't miss it. Damn straight. Don't bet any public buildings this time. <laughs> Varric is best Viscount. God, he's a goddamn Viscount. Oh, good! Iron Bow and everyone else is here! Oh, no more time for heart attacks. <laughs> oh, for a second there, I thought that was Bethany. Wait a minute, what? Hi, Blackwell! How you doing, honey? Let's make sure everybody's here. I'll be very angry if somebody's missing. Fashionably late. I thought you weren't gonna show. Of course I was. I gave you my word we would talk, and I never break my word. Yep, easy that's there. true. I was just teasing. That's easy there. So that, tell me that's everything there. that that's happened true. while I was away. I never break my word. Stop it, Skype! I'm busy. And Garolf strolls up, hands filled with ripe squashes, and says, Sir, I must report that it was an utter boondoggle. <laughs> what? <laughs> what have you been doing, Tom? Uh, Blackwall? Tom Rainier? Maybe you had to be there. His new life suits you. It's good to see you fitting in. It has its warts, that's for sure. But this life feels right. Like it's where I'm supposed to be. Anyway... It's nice to be back, though I'm not sure what to think of this council. I better have Varric in my party. I'm going to be me, so angry if I don't. They aren't going to keep me away from a friend who might need my sword arm. Oh! Uh, maybe you should stop. <laughs> I'm getting a little worried for the palace and, and then any passerby. Pass by. <laughs> <laughs> sword arm, not throwing arm. Cassandra? Hi Cole! How you doing, honey buns? How you doing? How you doing, bruh? Inquisitor, I see you have time for afternoon refreshments. Uh, Cole? Did you know that a merchant in the courtyard is selling gemstones the same color as your eyes? Cole! What an odd thing to say. Hmm, I must see this for myself. How have you been, Cole? We haven't talked to you in a while. I appreciate the help getting him elsewhere. I still don't understand Orlesians and their masks, but it makes him happy. And I needed the table. <laughs> For breadcrumbs. Birds still like breadcrumbs. Still as weird as ever. Aww. Oh, Cole, good day. I didn't see you there. Nobody ever sees him. But I saw you, as lovely as your songs. Oh my god! He's got a girlfriend! I'm pleased for both of you. The world has ample pain, Inquisitor. 
the kindness found in coal is rare indeed. Because they wouldn't let me romance Those songs them. bring happiness to those who hear, and I can make her happy in return. Aww. Well then, carry on. Have fun, you two lovebirds. I have no idea who that girl is. Scout lays Harding, swift and calm. There's a s There's a song about Harding as well? Yes. Where's Bull? Sarah! Sarah, Sarah, Sarah. Sarah Here's Sarah, you Sarah. and everyone. Glad to be back all stuffed together. With the pressure full Hold on. on. Again. Again. <laughs> Don't worry, Herald of Everywhere. I came prepared. I know what everyone needs. Pranks. Pranks? I'm thinking pranks. Just like best times. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm gonna get in so much trouble. Oh my god, what? Roof. It's early. Anyway, that was a good run. It's all been a good run. I needed that. And I need... You, you know need... it's ending, right? We can say it won't, but knobs in places like this. All they do is end things. Yeah. Even I can tell... I won't I'm... let it! No, I won't be stupid anymore. Um, I wrote it down so I wouldn't... So I can just tell you, and it's done. Oh no, she's breaking up with me. Sarah, if you're worried about something, you should just tell me. Eight, nine, ten. Is she done talking? Continue. <laughs> I like you, but hate change. But I can't stop it this time. Usually, I hope it doesn't matter, because lots of times I feel I've seen things before. So who cares? It'll all come round again. But every day, I've never felt this with her. And if it's always only once, then I can't, um, I didn't, <laughs> the rest is just sketches, there's flowers, and I think it's your butt. Oh, uh, really? So, marry me? Oh my god, she's proposing! <laughs> I mean, it's whatever, but you and me are somehow really, really good, and all these endings can get right off that. Really shiny, for real. Want to get married? A thousand freaking yeses! A thousand freaking yeses! I'll do it! You're a loony. Tell me, do. That's a yes? All the yeses. Every freaking one. I'm gonna get married! <laughs> Sarah's never been upgraded to life status. She, she, she and Varric and I can live in a mansion together. In Kirkwall. Oh my god, they're doing it now! Bells, we freaking win! Where did she get that dress? <laughs> I want it. I want that dress. Aww. I got married to Sarah! <laughs> yes! Yes! Love you, Sarah. Hello, love. Tell me do when we're done fixing things. I have sideways plans for you. Really? <laughs> Hi, Bull! Worship. Hi, Krem. I'm glad you're here. What Listen, happened? I need you to keep the chief distracted while we sneak this dragon skull through the room behind him. Uh, this should be good. I'm looking forward to seeing where this goes. It's for his birthday. It's his I'll birthday? I can do, Krem. All right, here he comes. Just keep him talking. He loves talking. Yes, he does. Hi, Bull. Hey, boss. Good to see you. Can't say anything there I am. Okay, I give up. I haven't seen a rift in ages. It's good to see that the veil has largely healed, now that most of the major rifts are closed. You might think otherwise, but the veil isn't technically a physical barrier. Stall. It's more like a magical vibration. I'm so that bad at stalling people. I'm so mm. bad at stalling people. I'm so bad at stalling people. Have <laughs> I just passed the freaking truck? Do you think news of the Exalted Council could affect the Lyrium shipments from Orzammar? Possibly. Uh, maybe. <laughs> stall, stall, stall. Go faster, youths! Go faster. How did they not notice that? 
It's fascinating to see the remnants of Syrian culture here. Most of it was deliberately <laughs> erased during Orlesian unification under the reign of Mafrath's son, Isarath. Uh-huh. I regret nothing. <laughs> what in the world? <laughs> Krem's like, I will end you. <laughs> I love Krem. She's the best. Did you know that Ferelden has its own names for lords? The country is divided into Tairnirs, governed by Tairns. Inside those are cities and Arlings ruled by Arls, and then there's the Banorn. It's a large area of countryside ruled by multiple bands. <sighs> Everybody gets banned. to know. <laughs> Hurry up, Krem! I'm out of things to talk about. Okay, I give up. I got nothing else to say. Uh, I'm sorry, I can't do this. Sure you can. They must have that thing almost across the room by now, right? <laughs> he knew the whole time! <laughs> ben Hasra, remember. <laughs> Surprise! Happy birthday, Chief! Damn it, Iron Bull! Oh, you guys! You got me! No, they didn't. No, they didn't. <laughs> Wow. Swift and cunning, arrows Is that Josie? Cole, Blackwall. Sandra! Cassie! Cassie, Cassie, Cassie! 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 Cassie? What the hell are you doing all the way over here? Oh. Are you okay? Cassie? Is everything all right? Yes. Well, I wanted to speak with you, and now you're here. Cassie? You seem distraught. This seems serious. It's not about me. It's about you. Okay. Honey? Maybe you should sit. Are you pregnant? I can stand. Am I the father? Maybe I should sit. What did you do? Is that shoulder armor new? Inquisitor, I want you to know that I am your friend. I will always be your friend. What did you do? Oh. Well, that's... So I hope to give you sound advice on this momentous day. What did you do? Do what is in your heart, my friend. No matter what anyone might tell you. I'm confused. <laughs> I really can't imagine what you mean. Oh. I'm talking about marriage. Oh, getting married to Sarah. Marriage? Of course, it is Sarah. Maker knows how it will end, but that doesn't me- It's already happened. You're not proposing to anyone. I've already gotten married. Okay, it probably wasn't official, but- I'm going to kill Varric. Why do I believe everything he says? <laughs> Damn it, Varric. Because you love him. So about that, <laughs> Sarah and I may have already gotten married. About that, you did here in the palace. Oh, the garden would be perfect for a wedding. Being inquisitor has brought you good things, many good it's things. It's like we might already be married. Sorry, but only a few have been by your choice. Take what happiness you can from those, and do not let them go. I won't. Don't worry that about it. That is all I meant to say. Advice from a friend for the days to come. No problem, honey buns. Um, we gotta go talk to Joe. Um. What? Oh, cool! I found Foundry. That's going to be helpful. Good. Josie! Wonderful. She's inside and upstairs. She's up there. She's up there! There's Varric. We're missing Vivienne. We're missing Vivienne. 
I'm not sure how I feel about missing Vivienne. Then again, she was the most likely person to be missing. Vivienne? Vivienne? Sandra? That one's not telling me. Blackwall Merchant. Yeah, I think we're missing Vivienne. <laughs> Hi, Josie. It's been quite a day so far, has it not? <clears throat> Just a little. I've been speaking with representatives from everywhere. Have they given you trouble? Not Probably. at all. It is oh. quite alarming. It means they are all saving themselves up for later. That's not good. Would you walk with me? I should like to take some air before the Exalted Council becomes inescapable. Sure, why not? The palace has been most accommodating. We are, after all, here at their insistence. But the ministers may... No. Ministers may... No more talk of the Council. There we go! This meeting <laughs> was to spend time with you in a more relaxed fashion. It's okay, Josephine. I've met your voice actor. She's very nice. Um... <laughs> Relaxing isn't your strength. <laughs> your tense is a bowstring. <sighs> I'm so very dreadful at this. Oh, it's okay, honey. The truth is, there is a small entertainment happening tonight, to which I may be able to find a pair of invitations. Really? You'd like me to go with you? Oh, very much <clears throat> so. In all the years you've worked with something Orlando, horrible is going so to happen. Little time to enjoy its culture. Something horrible is going to happen. Perhaps you're right. These meetings and talks don't allow for much leisure time. Nope. And then back to Skyhold without a moment's pause to take in where we are. With all that's been happening, if they expand the Inquisition, what happens to Skyhold? Evening out. I'd very much like to go with a friend. Sure. Let's go. Thank you for thinking of me. I'd be delighted to attend. Splendid. I will arrange things at once. The past years have been so busy. There's no Vivian. Vivian at least doesn't like a few me. moments of rest. A calm night out sounds. Um. Oh, bravo. Oh, bravo. okay then. <laughs> I'm just looking horrified. What just happened? Was the woman in gold playing a king? Who was the man in feathers? Oh, it's all very simple. The first actor's mask is determined by... Uh, well, I will lend you the program guide. Why did you let me know beforehand? Tell me, did you enjoy the performance? Um... That's to make her happy. It was fun. That was... One of the greatest things I've ever seen. Even though I didn't understand a word of it. Truly. That part with the glittery. And they actually set fire to. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> yes. I truly enjoyed it. Despite the look of horror then on I my face. I call tonight a great success. Cool. Oh, look. The encore signal. Encore signal? <laughs> wow. So that just happened. Okay. So I guess we don't get to uh, hang out with Vivienne. Oh wait, no, she's there. And Cullen. Oh, that's good. I was like, wait a minute, do we just not get to talk to Vivienne like at all, ever? It looks like we've got all my party here. I'm still gonna be angry if I can't have Varric in my party for uh, the upcoming celebrations. I'll be very, very cross. What are you? What are you doing, Cullen? <laughs> Aww. Yeah, you're to dodge, not catch. <laughs> Damn it, if that Cullen. Were a fireball, you'd be dead. <laughs> puppy, puppy. You found a dog. They don't breed Mabari in Olay. The merchant said he was abandoned. Perhaps his owner's tired of the novelty. Aww. But he's such a good dog. Tired of you. With that positive attitude and fetching ability. Aww! I like He's Mabari's. not supposed to fetch it. <laughs> I don't think you understand how this works. I don't think you understand dogs. The Winter Palace. I couldn't leave him to that fate. Besides, huh? I think he likes me. Aww, Cullen's got a puppy. That's adorable. You could take him to Ferelden sometime. You should know where he came from. I did promise my sister a visit. 
She might try to spoil you. <laughs> Remember who you report to. <laughs> Best puppy ever! The Inquisition will change after this. I'm not yet sure what that will mean. Whatever happens, our people, you, Liliana, Josephine, will have my support in whatever form you require. Thank you, Colin. <clears throat> well, in a good dog training. If your support <laughs> comes with that of your new friend, I'm sold. I know a useful ally when I see one. <laughs> puppy, puppy. You can help. Dodge this, and I'll find overpriced Orlesian dog treats before we go. Overpriced Orlesian dog treats. <laughs> How overpriced is overpriced? I don't know how much I pay you, Cullen, but oh, yes. don't want you to, you know, run out of food money or anything. Vivian! You're around here somewhere. There you are, dear darling. Darling, you made it. Excellent. I scheduled this appointment ages ago. Scheduled? And they do appreciate punctuality. What did you do? Appointment? Yeah, <laughs> that look just says play along. Garden Spa, of course. You work so hard, my dear. I wanted to treat you. A spa? <laughs> they serve elves there? I've never heard of a fancy spa serving elves. You are the Inquisitor, darling. Savior of the Empire. They won't turn you away. This is gonna end poorly. <laughs> I'm in a spa! What are the cheese wheels for? <laughs> yeah. It pains me that you even have to ask. You've clearly been living too long in barely civilized conditions. Sarah? Did you hear something? Relax, darling. It's spa day. How have you been? It seems ages since we've spoken. Is everything going well between you and Sarah? Um, things are good. Things are excellent. Thank you for asking. I'm glad to hear it. You've done so much, darling. You deserve to be happy. Sarah, what are what are you planning? How do you think the conference will end? What do you think they'll decide? It's all foolish posturing. The nations of Thedas know they can only politely ask the Inquisition to be on its way. <laughs> yep, they can't make us do anything. Don't you feel better, my dear? This place really does work miracles. What were we even doing? What happened? You didn't Darling, even explain the cheese spa wheels. Day. Don't fret. You'll it's undo spa all the day. good they've done. Come along, Inquisitor. They have other appointments, you know. What are we doing? And what is Sarah planning? Okay, never mind. Is that everybody? I think I've caught up with everybody. Okay, we'll talk to the ambassadors in the next video. My name is Miss Scarlet Temperature, and I have been playing some Dragon Age Inquisition Trespasser DLC. I'll see you all in the next video.